Welcome to another tutorial for the All Pro Football Editor new version. Today we're going to talk to you about the navigation. Uh, this was talked about briefly in the general controls tutorial, um, but we're going to go into a little bit more depth, but it should be pretty quick uh, to show you the different navigation you can use. So navigation is important when you're trying to create rosters or moving around in your season or franchise mode. And on the left side here, this is your side panel navigation. This is your main navigation where you have every single page that you can view. Depending on if you're on a roster file or a season file, you're going to see a different set of icons. But if you want to go from screen to screen, you can do so through the menu. You can also do some navigating through the browser buttons here. This will take you back and forth from page to page and your home button takes you to your team page. Um, one of the things that you can also do is you can expand only in the full screen mode. You can expand the side panel so you can see exactly what screens you're looking at. You also have screens inside of screens, like here you have divisions. Um, inside of tools, you have different tools that you could open up. <clears throat> you also have the ability to right click in some of these grids here and have some controls and navigation that happens through here as well. So if we go back to the regular view. Um, you also have the team menu where you can navigate from team to team. No longer do you go back and forth. Um, you just need to click on this team icon here and it can change depending on what screen you're in. You can go to the right over here um, if you're on the schedule, um, clicking on these will do different things, but on si inside of here, you can still change the screen. And depending on what option you're looking at inside of the tools menu, you can also change teams. And this one will actually change the team. So when you do an update to your team, it knows which team to do it for. Uh, and that's pretty much it for navigation. So it's pretty simple, pretty, pretty clean and I uh, hope you like it and hope it works for you. So thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next tutorial. See ya.